three-peat in any sport is quite a feat. And that's exactly what the Franklin combined team is hoping for this March. It's all the more impressive in gymnastics, where one-tenth of one point can be the difference between winning and losing. We're all in it this year. Most of our team's seniors, so we definitely want it even more than like the last two years. A lot of individual gymnasts that are very talented um, would love to have a group behind them like these kids do. And um, it takes all the right things need to happen to put this much talent in one place. Franklin combined includes Franklin, Muskego, Oak Creek, and Whitnall. And the girls affectionately call themselves FMO. And they hope to carry that mo as in momentum into the postseason. They currently reside as Wisconsin's top team. I think it's definitely motivational because it's, it always pushes us to be the best that we can be. So even when we think that we did a good job, we know that we can always do better and I think it really pushes us to be the best that we can. The margin of victory for Franklin over Burlington in the last two state championships was very, very tight. In fact, they've met a couple of times over the last month and they were also very close contest. But Franklin has their own strategy to deal with this added pressure. We try not to watch the other teams, so we try to watch, like, pay attention to ourselves and not pay attention to how they're doing. Um, and I think that makes us focus on just ourselves rather than trying to beat them. Everyone like focuses on like one thing like that week that'll help us improve that score, and like not really focus on like what everyone else is like doing around us. The high school season only lasts for a few months, but the training for these girls is a year-round commitment. Every summer these girls are working hard and they've gotten better every year. Come season we're working out six days a week. We're going into the weight room and um, they're really willing to do what it takes to get better. We come in here to try to have a positive attitude and motivate each other and um, we're very supportive of each other so I think that helps a lot too and we're a very close team. We go to the weight room, we stay after the gym to practice on skills that we really want. Like We're really just putting a, a ton of effort into this last season. Girls, congratulations. All your hard work has brought you to the top of your game. You are the Robert Hack Diamonds Team of the Week. Woo!